science, yes we do. We love science, yes we do. We love science, science you. We love science, science you. When I say science, you say you. Science you. Science you. Today we extract strawberry DNA, a dynamic code for life. DNA. Every living thing has DNA, deoxyribonucleic acid, which, like a recipe book, holds all the instructions for how organisms, like strawberries, create more strawberries. Mm. For this experiment, you'll need 70% isopropyl rubbing alcohol, fresh strawberries, salt, liquid dish soap, a medium-sized mixing bowl, measuring spoons and measuring cup, a small and large beaker or glass, a strainer, a funnel, a Ziploc bag, and a pair of tweezers. First, mix together one third cup of water, one half teaspoon of salt, and a tablespoon of dish soap into a solution. This is your extraction liquid. Put three big strawberries in the bag. Add three tablespoons of the extraction liquid in with the strawberries. Seal it up, making sure you press out all of the air. Then start mashing. You don't squeeze it too hard, yeah. Mush, mush, mush. <laughs> Once mashed into a paste, Strain the strawberry mush through a cheesecloth into a cup. It smells like a strawberry shampoo. Next, parents, get chilled rubbing alcohol from the freezer. Measure and gently pour one half cup of the alcohol into the strawberry mixture. Then you watch. It's like it's like separating, doesn't it? Whoa, what's, Whoa. what's up there? DNA? You see that? In the mushed up solution, the soap has a part that attaches onto the strawberry cell membranes and pulls them away into the water, separating the membrane from the DNA inside the cell. The salt creates an environment that causes the DNA to clump together. When we slowly add the less dense alcohol with the strained strawberry solution, it layers on top, pulling the DNA away into the cloudy clumps that you can collect with tweezers. You can see the DNA. Yes, that cloudy gunk is the strawberry's DNA, its dynamic blueprint of life. Strawberries are great for this experiment because they have very, very much DNA.